Hi, welcome to Organs of Super with me, David Cooper. And today I've got for you to see a beautiful Ringway RS800. The RS800 is one of the newer of the Ringway ranges and it gives us a great choice of sounds, of styles, of uh, registrations and it's got a nice lid that comes down. Glass lid, there we go. Comes with a nice matching bench and it's very streamlined. It's a nice nice looking piece of furniture but modern and contemporary as well. It's got a good screen. If you come up to the screen here, look, we can see it's going to give us all the information. We've got the, the upper lead voices, lead one and two, pedal voice uh, one and two. We've got the upper sounds uh, and then we've got the lower voices so we can see very clearly everything that's going on and if we go into a sound selection let's go in, into this button here that we've got different pages in this case there's only one if we go into um, say one of these over here we've got three of four so we can go between all of the choices in that section with these page up and down buttons and the same with the styles if we go to a rhythm style sorry if I go to big band and we've got page one of three and we've got the choices which we can go through to but just under here we select from the top row or the bottom row so i can go to simple swing or up to big band fast down to acid jazz or back up to big band ballad okay so we've got a good selection on the screen here um let's go and see what it will do for us we've got these uh, bank a b c and d buttons and they all give us a whole selection of 16 registrations so there's uh, for 64 ready to go straight away but one of the things that i particularly like on this instrument if we go into the uh, registration button here demo reg we've got a big list and on this list are 32 settings for the whole instrument that we can use including rhythm styles if we want to use them and we can select one at a time so let's see what some of them sound like piano and strings i just press load and that loads okay there we go and i can now start playing so piano and strings <laughs> sounds. Uh, the next one is actually called large strings. So let's see if that's any larger. Yes. orchestrated settings for the instrument just with a flick of a uh, control here and then loaded them in so we've got a brass ensemble let's see what that sounds <laughs> Isn't it? I love that. Okay, let's do some more. We've got orchestra and chorus together. <laughs> Can do we can decide whether we want that bass sound to be manually played or whether we want to play it ourselves on the automatic chord so we've got fingered chord and we can bring that in with a lower pedal and auto chord and bass 
And now when I play, if I put a, a start stop on or synchro start with an intro, that will actually give me a suitable backing can, linked up to this sound. Let's see what we're going to get. Very different to what I expected. Great rhythm. styles that we can bring in if we wanted to with any of these backings let's try another one we've got a um, uh, pop flute and guitar let's load that in let's see what style comes with pop flute and a guitar style introduction a bit slower oh, i'm going to turn the bits on that's why let's put those on as well and do that again synchro start intro easy to get straight into it now if we want to do it ourselves and we can go in and choose sounds ourselves we can go back to the the main screen and we can select sounds that mix together so we've got our upper upper section and our upper two section and we can mix voices from both of those together so we could say right let's go into the first section and let's pick uh, there's uh, piano and I might want to mix that with the second so I'll bring the volume up to the second section and I'm going to mix it with strings. Now I've got my strings selected, but I've also got all these other choices. So I could say strings one or five or six. We'll go back to an earlier page. So I can choose the sound I want and select it. choices and each sound section has got a large amount of uh, sounds to choose from because each button isn't just that one sound so that string button alone is going to give me uh, six pages if we go to the last page we've got four and this is five eight so 40 four to choose from just in that string section and then something else we can do as well just come to the screen and say if I press the string button the second time we then get all these controls to edit that sound so I've got volume brilliance I've got um, the sort of EQ in there. We've got the, the footages. So I can change that string sound to different octaves. Listen to the difference, how much that makes. So we can change any of the sounds between five different octaves to give us a really good spread. And that can make a huge difference. If I put the piano now, and we go into the piano sound and change the octave, we can go upwards and down. So it totally changes the whole, the whole sound. So we've got our two upper sections here, and then we've got two lead voices. And these are the solo instruments we can have coming through. And if we want to, the solo instruments can come down to the lower keyboard, the top of the lower keyboard. So we could have, let's put one on here, let's put a violin down here. Okay, we've got a trumpet. So we can have that alongside our lower voices that are down here. And we can have an extra sound coming through. So lots of things that we can move around. The rhythm section, the nice thing about this, because it's such a new instrument, is the rhythms are very modern. So if we go into, we've got a dance section, we've got rap. So if I put a rap rhythm on, let's have a look at that. Very modern sort of sounds. Let's go to something different. Let's go into that one again. And we'll go to um, some like dance pop. But 
that's alongside all the standard ones. Big band, we've got big band fast. <laughs> Simple swing. That's nice. Let's try another one. Let's go to uh, Jazz Club. And then on top of that, we've got the intros and we've got the fillings. Another one. Let's go into um, jazz ballad. So intro. That's nice. Okay. Then we've got the second one, a B. Back and more drums going on. I've got the fillings. Okay, so lots to choose from. This is the RS800. This is the Ringway. It's one of the later ones, so it's very digital, but very easy to use. If you want to, you can memorize your own settings into these white buttons rather than use all the ones that are built in from the factory. Um, give us a shout if you want more details on this. This is the Ringway RS800. I'm David Cooper. No, August the Super with me, David Cooper.